I'm going to show you instead of if you have an XYZ printer, I'm using a DaVinci 1.0 uh, XYZ kind of doesn't print right half the time. You can't do as much stuff with it as you can slicer, so I like to use slicer. Well, if you don't want to flash your uh, DaVinci, which I didn't want to right away. So what I do, how to use slicer is basically come in the slicer. Here's all your print settings. Set them up how you want to. Then once you get everything the way you want it, and oh, make sure you go into your firewall and stop XYZ from phoning home. Or this might not work. If you don't know how to do that, I'll make another video later showing you how to do that. But you just hit export G code. Once you do that, it'll ask you where you want to save it at. I put it in a G code folder, but I already have one saved. So I'm not going to do it plus for time's sake. But you just hit that, and then if we go in here to the folder, right here's my Yoda 2 G code. I'm going to open it with Notepad Plus. And then what we're going to do is we're going to delete this top line, all this right here. Boom. I'm anal, so I'm going to backspace this. All right, where it says filament amount, you want to scroll down here to the bottom. And right here, just copy the number. Then scroll back up. It right here we're gonna paste it boom then we're gonna go back in the slicer and then we're gonna go to layers we got 3.190 layers so we're gonna put three point or thirty one point nine zero then we're gonna hit control A we're going to go to Plugins, MMM Tools, Base64 Encode. Boom. Then hit File. Save As. And I saved it as my Yoda 2 in here, which I already have somewhere. Screw it, I'll just put it in again. Yoda 2. And then save it as dot 3w. Then you click on that, open it up in X, it'll open it up in XYZ, which I've already done that. And right there it is, already sliced and ready to go for you. All you gotta do is hit print, and it'll print. I hope that helps you all out. Alright, thanks guys.